All right. Episode 46. No, 47. Wow. Uh, flies by. Episode 47. We're back <laughs> here in Laguna Niguel because Sarah's has not busted yet. I don't like when you say that. <laughs> you know what Corbin said the other day that I thought was really funny? She was like kicking and like moving around. My uh, body looks like an alien body. And he said, she's preparing for her final dive. Oh. <laughs> and I was like, You're She's right. preparing for her trip. She's going on a trip. She's preparing for her trip into the world. She hasn't entered our realm yet. Yeah, she's She's not. in the in-between. She is. And she doesn't even know what she's about to start. Yeah, she's going to have to breathe air. I know. She's underwater. She's a mermaid right now. She breathes water. She breathes water. Blood. There's no blood in there. In your stomach? Yes. Not not in, not in her <laughs> special space. She's not surrounded by you blood. Think, you think there's no blood in there? No. Come on. There's no blood in there. Come on, there's blood in you. Yeah, but she's not swimming in my blood. She's in my stomach, which is, and she's surrounded by water. I'm getting really creeped out thinking about blood inside my you body started. right now. <laughs> and I don't like where it's going or where it's taking me mentally. Can we please move on? Yeah, I'd love to move on. Are you pregnant? No. Okay, let's get you there. <laughs> so you can laugh at me? Yeah. Anyway, episode 47, we're getting close to the actual over the hill age. I Wait, okay, what, what, what do we consider over the hill? Well, it's 40, but we said it was 50. Did we say 50 is over the hill? Because that's Let's halfway. Let's say 60. Well, that means you're going to live to 120. Yeah, that's the hope. Okay. We'll be here. You wouldn't want to live to 120. If I was a fucking cool ass bitch. Okay, I would too. If I have my brain and I could still wipe my butt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm down to go. You know, I got to tell you something. Okay. I have been in a cottage cheese drought. Thank God. Yeah. Are you doing this for my baby? Because I think this is like the way to bring her in is like no cottage cheese for the next No, two unfortunately, weeks. I just haven't made a trip to the grocery store to get more. Oh. And I, I don't really feel myself. I don't feel that I can be. Why don't you Postmates it? I could, but I really want to go be one. Be one. What store do you go to? Any stores. Sprouts, Whole Foods. I don't get my cottage cheese from Trader Joe's. Though. Ralph's. Yeah, maybe Ralph's. But I really, I really feel you disconnected. Love Trader Joe's. Or not anymore. Oh. I feel very disconnected from myself because I don't have any, any sort of. You should try a better breakfast. Cottage cheese. You know what I had the other day? Hopefully a bagel. I had protein powder. Why do you always have to mix in protein powder <laughs> with your breakfast? Come on, man. Chocolate milk. And an espresso shot. That's that's kind of delicious. Oh god, I keep thinking like my dad is here, man. Yeah, you worried, huh? Yeah. Um, that sounds weird. You, you Why think? don't you have protein? Pa- Can't you just save your protein powder for your smoothies? Do everyone that a favor. is my smoothie. No, that's it's your- an espresso chocolate smoothie. Did you blend it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I put ice in there and then I blended it. Oh, okay, that doesn't. It was a that little bad. mocha. I want that when I go home. Okay. Um, but it's so funny. My friend Julia, who you know, yes, I do, and we she, we work together. <laughs> yeah, she she's very honest, and that's why we're friends because oh. she she's very blunt. Oh and, wow! You no, know, I'm I'm the same way. Sometimes my feelings get hurt when people are too straight with me. Well, get with it. Be a little soft, especially right now. You know, like I went to dinner with her, and she goes, Alina. You talked about protein so much in the last few episodes. (laughs) And I was like, oh, sorry. Okay, good to know. Noted. And she goes, oh, sorry. I'm probably, you know, I did. I I listened to them back to back to back in a drive. So maybe I noticed it more than other people. But like, we get it, Alina. You drink, you eat a lot of protein. And you work out. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, oh, man. Oh, can we start the SC? Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. We could be doing anything at any time in any place. Five minutes in. You know what? My arm itches so bad. And I got to scratch. Should we pause until? <sighs> you know when it feels good, you know? You know, I haven't really been itchy lately. You're dry. Um, That's your perception. <laughs> <laughs> 
Just because I'm... Run the tapes. You called yourself a dry, crusty bitch. Yeah, but I'm not itchy about it. I think because I've just been dry for so long, I no longer itch. Got it. Got it. I had this friend say this to me this one time. They were like, you know, the more you put on chapstick, like the just drier lips are going to become. So I was like, okay. It's kind of the same thing with, you know, Diet Coke. You know, like the more you drink it, the thirstier you get. Is that true? No. I feel like Coke... (laughs) I feel like Coca-Colas don't quench any thirst. And I, I say Coca-Cola as a general phrase of any soda. Yeah, it dehydrates you. Caffeine. Like it doesn't, because it, ta- it smells so bad to me mm-hmm. that it doesn't feel like, if I smell grape juice, I'm like, oh God, yeah, yeah. knock me off my fucking feet. If I smell orange juice, I'm like. <laughs> huh. But if I smell soda, I'm like. Bleh. I have a question. It's totally related. <laughs> if you could be a drink, get rid of if, if you're if you're change butt, anything about myself. <laughs> if, if your butt could not be two separate entities, what do you mean? Like you know, your butt is a one, and then it's a two. So you, are you saying like if you could have one cheek instead of two? Yeah, if you could have one cheek and there's no crack in the middle. Yeah, but you never poop again. Yeah, would I choose that? Would you choose it? No, I like my my cheeks spread. My cheeks too. <laughs> my cheeks spread. I didn't send you. Like, that in. You like your cheeks spread? I like to have the ability to poop. I wouldn't want to give it up. I'm shocked because you don't like pooping. I poop privately, and I poop you quickly. poop quickly. So to me, people who are quick poopers are people who don't really enjoy the uh, you know the I don't enjoy, the leisurely no. and the relaxation involved with pooping. I don't enjoy bathrooms. Okay. That's the issue. So you have the ability to never poop again. Yeah. Nothing's coming out. No. I I would like to let's explore what this. I, what I How would, would you excrete your food in this in this alternate armpits, reality? Armpits. Oh, you think you'd sweat out your it, it has to be another cracky area. So your knees, your pits. Do you think it would come out like sap? You know when you cut a plant and the white goop comes out? You I think hope it would you still come you, out like poop. Oh, you think you you would hope? <laughs> we're making all of this up well i don't think people should have the option to not i think poop. i think i would hope that it would come out sappy and it would be why your, would you want it would be your mother's all down lotion your that she m- hand makes so then when it comes out you can rub it in like lotion you won't even rub your poop around your body it wouldn't be my poop it's it my it would homemade have, lotion but it's discreet it's excreting. it is my poop it is your poop but it comes out in the form of lotion and it buds out. So you're out. changing all the rules <laughs> of this game. What you're telling me now is, okay, you have no cheeks, you have un butt, uno butt, and you've moved poop to this nice lotiony smell that will just We're now making it up that, as we that go. are now excreting naturally to your legs. You said armpits, so it gave me the idea. Well, it had to be a crack area. You can't just say it's like coming out your button, your well, belly what button. If it came out of your belly button. Imagine how dirty your shirts would get if you had poop all over your shirts. You'd have to like you wear a diaper over your button. Not necessarily. You could you could close it. You could tighten it like no, you no, tighten no. your butthole. This is just excreting. It just happens randomly. Yeah. Oh my god! And imagine like you f- you're sitting you in a fart meeting. out of your belly button, <laughs> and so it just comes directly into your own waft. Waft. <laughs> it wafts. It wafts into your nose. <laughs> directly in this sentence is a waft your nose. <laughs> It goes directly into your waft. Yeah. So in your mind, your waft was your smell zone. Yeah. It's crazy also that you don't fart out of your nose. Why? <laughs> Why is that? Why? It's a hole. It's on your body. But it's your breathing hole. It's not your farting hole. You don't breathe out of your butthole. Do we find that weird? <laughs> I think you do, actually. No, you don't. So if you're underwater and you're drowning <laughs> and you keep your ass above the water, you're going to be able to breathe through your butthole like a whale. <laughs> You could close it. You could snorkel breaching the surface. So they do call it a blowhole. What? No. What's our blowhole? We have. <laughs> this is our blowhole. This how, is come, a, how come nothing squirts out when we blow? They does your spit. Yeah, this is sloppy toppies talk. Talk right now. We're we're in the midst of it. <sighs> All right, now your turn. Okay, so I would choose to have poop continually just stay in my butthole place. Okay. And you? I would prefer the lotion sap. With no butt crack? 
Oh, I like my butt. Exactly. Yeah. So you'd have to have no oh, butt crack. No, no, no. <laughs> Give me my ass back. <laughs> <laughs> I take it back. I want the whole ass. <laughs> and I do like pooping. Why did I... I don't know. Why Everyone would I ever the choose the sap? I, I don't think it's because I'm dry right now. So I really would love to just excrete lotion. Anyway, but what's your hypothetical? Hypothetically, if we were doing this episode, when do you think we'll start our actual topics? <laughs> 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 I think we'll start in actually seven minutes. Okay. If you could, if you could be a whale or a shark, what would you choose? kind of shark great white okay or killer whale Ooh, i mean killer whales dominate the seas they do dominate the seas i'd be the killer whale i want to be the alpha okay what about you i'm going shark baby i'm going shark okay like, i have to it's it's on brand okay alex i mean i'm wearing a shark my shark t-shirt you answer would you rather have a butt and what about the sharks i would rather have my butt yeah as okay. is as two is. cheeks two cheeks small cheeks but still two of them uh, and I'd rather be a killer whale over a shark because you're swimming with your boys. You're in a pod. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm really a smart. Wolf. Yeah, lone wolf shark seems kind of scary. You can't go backwards. Yeah, the, there is that whole backwards situation. Yeah, yeah. But you get to kill people. So. It's killer whales mm, Killer whales can kill people also. They can, but they choose not to. They choose not to. They rise yeah, above. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But you Great run the sharks. risk of being put at SeaWorld. Yeah, a yeah, huge risk true. of SeaWorld. Yeah. There's no way I'm going to SeaWorld. That's true. Yeah, yeah. You're not and caught. I can also jump out of water like killer whales. It's true. And I take out seals. Sharks jump? In the yeah. South Africa, they do. I don't know if all sharks <laughs> jump, but this specific shark in this specific town is jumper. There, uh, th there are some videos of sharks jumping. Oh, yeah. It's like crazy. I'll, 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 I have one set up for the bonus that I, that I can think of that we should definitely watch. Okay, don't you dare. This is no time for this. Can you open a page and, and find who I am and oh, yeah. find you, who you are? Okay, so like today. Yeah. <sighs> so today, this is what Alina is going to be. Okay. So excited. An upside down shark that's getting tickled. <gasps> You're such a playful shark. Oh, my gosh. Is that my pee? No, that's not your pee. Okay, here's Alex. Oh, oh, that's white tip. This is yeah. white tip. This wait, is white wait, wait, wait. We got to show. We got to. What is this doing in here? Birthing stuff. <laughs> wait, go back to where I was. I can't. That's not the game. No, but everyone's got to see what it was. Well, I'd have to go through the entire thing. I didn't know there's a rule to this game. Okay, now here we go to me. Oh, okay. today I'm a hammerhead. Okay, go back to Alex. <laughs> she, just she doesn't know where they are. Okay, let's start over. Uh, <laughs> flip, flip. Can't get it off me. No, I want to be the shark that I was. Yeah, it was so, cute. Okay, well, you were you were a cute. Just, I was upside down getting my belly rubbed. You were upside down getting your belly rubbed. Alex was. The hell's going on here? Are you guys texting about girls? <laughs> no, no, no. We can do that in the bonus. Uh, it's a. You guys keeping stuff from me. Surprise for you. Okay. Yeah, I love to be surprised. Yeah. Any hooser. Now that we know our sharks for the day, yeah, let's talk about Leo. I saw him recently, and in the wild. You know what? I saw a meme today that said, um, "You know the two stars of The Last of Us." What's oh, his name? Yes, Pedro Pascal and, and, and the, Bella, Bella. Bella something. Yeah. Um, Bella age. Ramsey. So the age difference between Pedro and Bella is the same age difference between Leonardo DiCaprio and his new girlfriend. Yeah. You're joking. No, I'm not. Yeah. I'm serious. I know. It took me, it blew me away. Imagine Bella, Bella. with Pedro. I, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to. <laughs> no, I know. No, no. It's be, because it's like Okay, so how, how old is Leo's? I, 19. I didn't, 19. She, he has a new girlfriend. Yeah. Uh, uh, well, we let's think. pull her up. I'll pull her up. It's who he's linked to right now. 19? Yep. 19. She just graduated high school. They they, yep. they also said that her, how crazy it is, is it that her high school experience was interfered with by COVID? I thought that was a joke. No, no, it's I serious. saw that photo no. and I was God. like, oh, okay, funny joke. Yeah, oh, look at it right here. Let me see. S I same meme. Leo and <gasps> his girlfriend and Pedro and Bella. Like oh it, my God, that's so creepy. And you know I love Leo. And so that's why really, it's really hard What's, for me who, to like, How did he meet her? Maybe match.com or something? I don't know. You, who, who, listen. Can I see a picture of her? 
Of Leo's girlfriend? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, look her up. I know age is just a number, people. Even but age is still a thing <laughs> that people should be aware of. That's just too much. Of it. It's too years. much. That's a 30-year gap. Oh, my God. The hummingbird is out. Oh, <gasps> I told you. They oh. fucking battle each other here. I'm just kind of sad, you know? Like, I want sad Leo. That, sad that he doesn't know that he could get. Leonardo DiCaprio was her age in 1993. Oh, my God. Isn't that crazy? Oh, was that Titanic? No, that was oh. e- e- Gilbert Grape. Oh, good movie. No, but come on. Don't you think like, let's have Leo step it up to now be like the George He could Clooney. be with Margot Robbie, who's still young. No, she's married. married. She's she's married. married. I'm just saying. Yeah, yeah, I know. I Margot know. Robbie is gorgeous. There's so many beautiful women. His there's age. so many, be- oh, she's not even his age. She's still way younger. She's yeah. still. There's so many still beautiful like, women around 30. 13 years younger than him. Who? Ma- Margot, Margot Robbie? Robbie. Yeah. But that's what I mean. He's in his George Clooney phase now. He needs to find his wife, settle down, yeah. and have twins. Yeah, she looks really, really young. Really young. Are, do her parents know that she's seeing a 50-year-old? Her parents are probably 50. Her parents are probably 50. Yeah. Look, I know Leo's hot. Okay? I'm running that ship. I'm steering the boat. I love Leo. Oh, I want in and out so bad. How did this Same. just happen? What I'm what just made I'm you craving a burger? Why don't you get In and Out on your way home? Have Maybe. it. Be do it. Get French fries too. You can't go to In and Out and not get French fries. Oh man, you gotta wait in that. I line, am though. shocked right now about Leo that he's with someone. So I so saw, him, saw him, and you didn't even go up and, and get his autograph for I me. I didn't get his autograph. I did <sighs> take a little sneaky pic for you. I know. Thank you. And it's funny because all the dudes that he rolls with, they all wear. The, the same, same hats thing. and they kind of all look the same can we talk about and this? he was definitely you know hot no he was definitely seeming as if he was lurking this is what i have to say since you brought this up yeah since you brought this up i'm gonna like veer off what Go the fuck it. do celebrities wear hats and glasses indoors and then say don't fucking notice i know Are when i when me? i wear sunglasses inside people look at me more as if oh. i at, because who the fuck would do that yeah exactly. exactly and then i realize, oh i'm disoriented i gotta take these off i take them off but when i have them on i go people probably think just when you wear sunglasses that you are somebody i know crazy if it's nighttime and you have a hat on and there's no sun and you're in the it's clubs it's true you're leonardo dicaprio did you there's no my, one else did you see be. my story last week or something it was no. ollie with the hat on he looked exactly oh, like leonardo wait, DiCaprio. he did he did look like leonardo DiCaprio. crazy was, how, how ollie could look just like him with he's that. spot on yeah i've never he, seen he's the, indoor in a bed i know leo would do that i gotta send you that picture leo would totally do it with somebody with a hat on oh my god i didn't even think about yeah. that yeah do you think he's ever taken that hat off has he ever washed his hair Maybe I, love I think he does a backwards cap for the sex for part. sex. <laughs> well, who else wears something? I wonder if they every would... other like popular celebrity always has a fucking hat and sunglasses on. No, but I'm saying, you know, is someone known for something? And I'm wondering if they if they take it off. Is someone known for something? And, and do they take it off? That's the question, <laughs> you guys. Let's think. You know, people are known for things, I think. People are out there being known. You know, if someone is known for wearing a scarf, do they leave their scarf on when they bone? Also, scarves. We're think, in California, baby. I think your mom's gone. She is. I have something I want to talk about. <gasps> She's going to hear the episode. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, you, can't, you can't have to say it now. No, I'm not saying it. Well, I don't want to sidetrack, but we were talking about Leo wearing things during sex. sex. And you, had you guys heard the headphone rumors before? That he wears headphones during sex? Yeah. yeah. Okay. What, to listen to his own no, dialogue no. in Titanic? <laughs> <laughs> no, but like, why doesn't he just play Wait, music out loud? You know what I mean? Why does he listen to them? Uh, pay- people have like posted in gossip sites that they've hooked up with him or friends of theirs have hooked up with him and they'll turn, they'll be doing doggy or something. They'll turn around and he's wearing like big ass headphones, like, but big airplane headphones. Why? I don't know. To why is no one questioning why? They're having sex with Leonardo. They're going to yeah. they're gonna announce, oh yeah, we had sex and he's wearing headphones, but they're not going to bother to ask why or investigate? It doesn't seem like they're talking. It seems like they're messing Why do you think around. he would wear headphones? Can we at least have know. a discussion about it? Obviously, something's off if he's standing a 19-year-old. Do you think he's trying to, A, drown them out? Potentially. B, listening to himself? I don't, I fucking Or C, so. listening to a romantic, you know, soundtrack of sorts? I have to assume it's not a romantic soundtrack. Yeah, what do you okay. mean romantic? Like Drake? I, I yeah I, I you know is he listening to some 
some let's have sex but the, music. But to me, why wouldn't he just put it on for the for the crowd, right. for the room? What if he likes Drake and you know other people don't like Drake? Who cares? I don't care. Like, you, you can't have to say it now. Like put it on if if you if you're gonna. Okay, l- so A, B, or C? Well, that's my. I don't think any of them. Okay. I, I, I don't even remember what the uh, answers were. Okay. <laughs> a. A. I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's what I mean. It was too no. quick. A. Is he putting it on to drown out their sounds, their moaning, or whatever? Okay. Okay. B. Is he listening to himself? Is he listening to his own voice, coaching him through how to, or his monologue in Titanic? Or C. Is what he listening to in Titanic? whatever he said oh you know when kate was over the side and she was gonna jump yeah or just you know don't let go anyway or c romance music of sorts to set the vibe i'm hoping it's romance c has some claims to people have claimed he listens to classical music oh. possibly when he's oh doing my god so. he is trying to be in a movie at all times that's how i want to live my life i was gonna say you guys have so much in common i kind of want to try headphones do it do it <laughs> And then report back. Oh my God, you know what would be so stupid though? Hmm. Is like AirPods. You'd look so stupid. <laughs> it's like if you're, oh. gonna, if you're gonna do it, I know. pull out these or motherfuckers. imagine they fall. I know. I-, I want Leo to direct a movie. I want to see him in the movie. Because honestly. I think there would definitely be some classical music during uh, SEX scene. Wouldn't that be funny? I know. I can't believe you saw. Was that your first time seeing Leo? No, it's my second time seeing Leo. I knew it. I knew you'd probably see the second time I had seen Leo. I was at John and Vinny's. You mean the first time? The first time I had seen Leo, I was at John and Vinny's. He was one table in front. He was wearing a hat. Oh, of course. What girl was he with? He was with a couple friend. Oh wow. Yeah, and Noel made a joke to the waiter that he must be some famous football player, right? And she did not understand that he was joking. Oh god. So she was like, "Huh." And then she walked away. Anyway, I took a picture of him. I we've talked about this. I remember. Didn't we? Yeah, I yeah. remember now. We put it on and and I had yeah, yeah, yeah. That. So now I I pretty me and him are friends. Yeah, you guys obviously could potentially hook up. Um, but no, I'm too old. That's true. I'm too old. Are too, we're yeah, over the did, hill. He won't even look at me. He wouldn't I, even look in our he direction. He doesn't even know I exist because my, you know, but you passed for an 18 year old in Europe. That's true. So you could be on his radar. So maybe I have a chance. Yeah. I don't want a chance. But get in there for the rest of us. I, you know, if I, and I, then, if I spoke to him, I would ask him to come on the podcast and I would ask him what's going on with the headphones. You would? Yeah. You blatantly for sure. Say. I say, you know, we're going to put the headphones on. Is there anything you'd like to listen to while we get classical? ready to start the podcast? What if he said I only listen to classical during sex? What if he just listens to moaning sounds? He could take off his headphones then. <laughs> <laughs> this is true. This is true. How do we get here? You know, that's what I always ask myself when I'm sitting here. Uh, you know what's so funny is, and I'm embracing it, you never cared about topics before. I didn't. I had my notebook with me. No. I cared so much about topics. Alex, back me up here. Alex, back me up. Didn't care to stay on track with the topics. No, I have no need to stay on track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No need to stay on track. <laughs> right, but right. I need a list of topics. That's you, true. You, That's you've true. always liked them. Yeah. But in terms of, okay, let's get to the next thing. Let's move to the next thing. You never you never cared. We, we would dodge around. It'd be really funny episodes. Yeah. But now, you're all you're all police with the topics. How did we get here? How did we get well, here? What's wrong with talking about Leo's headphones and what he's doing? No, I like it. I think it's an important discussion to have. And I wish I could have it with him. Right? I wish he could be here. Okay. In we're on the same house. page. I just want to make sure you're, you're liking where we're going. I here. love where we're going. There's nothing I could talk about more than Leo. I was also watching a Leo thing today about... Uh, today? What were you watching? I was watching... Eating Gilbert Grapes? No. Is I that was, the name of the movie? You're close. Do you want to try one more time? Gilbert's Eating grapes no what's eating gilbert grape <laughs> who's touching gilbert's grapes <laughs> my god that's his wall gilbert better not be a dog because those are poisonous no our grapes oh grapes are poisonous yeah don't keep them just get them out of your house they will die if they eat too many grapes <laughs> like you don't why am this? i just feeding my dog grapes i was never planning on it and also my dog but if they fell fruit. on the f- oh, yeah same with ollie if they fell on the ground and they ate them 
and i'm leaving them there i'm leaving my grapes on the ground well sometimes people leave food all around town not here it's very clean here (laughs) but food is left around town it's not like one grape will kill a dog yes no it's not well the size of a germ are you arguing with me i'm a hundred i'm not arguing with you i'm stating fact it's not one one grape will kill a dog maybe ollie because he's yeah that's what i'm saying one grape could anything but it's not killing archie or anybody i'm relating this I still think, Ollie. I think Ollie could eat one or two grapes and be fine. He'd probably poop a lot, but he wouldn't die. Let us know in the comments. Ollie is nine pounds. Archie is 35. Yeah. Perfect size dog. Also, 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 do you not have any grapes in your fridge because I of this I won't buy word? grapes. You don't eat grapes at all. But you're so afraid of dropping a grape. I, you you I don't even want them near them. What about chocolate then? <laughs> so do you not I buy like chocolate? chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> there, it is. there we there it is. go. Yeah. Yeah. Duh, duh. Well, I'm in the car. Grape just seems like an unnecessary thing to have if it's going to hurt him, you know? Okay, but chocolate's worth the risk. <laughs> he's also you allergic. You just don't like grapes as much he's as He's also like allergic chocolate. to chicken and we do have chicken, but he won't die How do you from know it. he's allergic to chicken? Yeah. Don't question me. <laughs> <laughs> we went through some stuff with Ollie. It was very hard times. Okay. I feel you. My dog escaped. You want me to tell you? No. I please please do. This is the Ollie listens to the podcast and he goes, Oh yeah, please tell my story. And then Sarah goes, Nope. <laughs> no. So he knows you don't Once like him. Once we connect, then we'll have a whole episode Hold of the now. Yeah, yeah. Of, uh, okay, let me quickly explain. So wait. Ollie was getting kind of sick. He was eating his food and uh, we fed him chicken type food and he was twisting his sides. He was whining. He just seemed like his stomach was in a lot of discomfort. We took him to the vet. They said, feed him plain chicken and white rice. We fed him plain chicken and white rice. He was like screaming (gasps) in pain. Jesus. He was just not himself. We were like really, really concerned that he had some sort of stomach cancer or something crazy had happened to him. So we. During COVID. Oh, okay. So we took him to urgent care because they said, you need to go get MRIs. You need to go get tests. Jesus we Christ. had to leave him in there overnight. He was crying. Oh, my God. Apparently, he went to the like pee in his crate because he was so scared. I feel sick about the story. Skip to the part where it's they, a happy uh, we, ending. They gave him back. They, they gave, and they go, he, everything looks fine. Everything looks normal. His stomach's a little bit inflamed, but there's nothing pointing to why any of this is happening. And no one could fucking okay. say what is he cool. Eating? So he just stayed in there overnight for no reason. He came, he brought him. He had a shaved patch on his body from where they had like done all the this stuff. stuff. It was the saddest. Can't bring thing. Ollie home. I'm sick of this shit. Okay, so we bring him home. We I said I'm gonna take him to a different vet. Get another opinion. This is like four vets in. And the lady goes, you know, there's a chance that he could be uh, allergic to chicken and poultry. And sometimes the de- allergy develops over time. Like he's kind of I- agitated by it, but it, it just comes, really gets agitated. Just comes out in in, in different ways. Um, try feeding him ground lamb and potatoes instead. So I was cooking him during COVID ground lamb and potatoes, and he's loving it. And instantly back to his normal self. No more stomach aches. Oh nothing. Then I found out uh, we met someone else who had a dachshund, and their dachshund was allergic to chicken. It, it, it just super normal. A lot of dachshunds are allergic to chicken. Wait, and they, the dachshund? Mm-hmm. We think. We believe. You haven't had him tested? I haven't had him. But he's got dachshund in him. I mean, look at him. He's long and wide and thin and we small and short. And What if he's you got, what if you got it back colors. and it was like gerbil? <laughs> 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 this man is related to a rodent. <laughs> That After was, that story, that's, but like, that's where you take but it. But how funny would it be? Like, I should call your when like you thing is like you're like doing it, like when you're sending in your oh, for sure, for sure, you should you do that. Call, I should be like, I'm on maternity hey. leave, and I'm like, hey, this is a really important call. I think you should put gerbil. On the what is it called when you try to, uh, to grab something in transit? What? <laughs> what are you fucking talking about? What are you talking about? When you try about? to interrupt a path. What? <laughs> Were you trying to grab something in transit? Intercept? Yes. Oh. Wow. My. Wow. God. Full guess. The way that that was described, I have never in my life heard an interception definition as grabbing something <laughs> in transit. <laughs> in transit. That's what it is. I mean, I guess technically, but. Oh my God, that was wild. <laughs> I don't even know if I can get past that and continue on. So Sarah would try to intercept the 
DNA. Yes, I would and call, call the, in and yeah. say, "Yo, yo, yo, hey, hey, hey! I need you to put gerbil on that <laughs> shit, and add add rat in there too, <laughs> and, just for fun." And hamster? No, he's he's not hamster. He ain't that. But but throwing gerbil, uh, maybe bunny. So now Ollie eats lamb. And he's okay. Fine. So what was the? How did we get? What was? What? I oh, show her the show her the Oh, this all led back to a TikTok of a lamb. I think I really want a lamb. What's everyone's thoughts on that? Give us are, a little more. Are lambs nice? I think they go I know the bah. sound. I know the sound they make. <laughs> I think but like I think you know how llamas are are assholes? Like everyone knows llamas think, are assholes. Like what's the census of a lamb? Well, if you got a lamb, that's a sheep, right? Yeah. What's the difference? <laughs> It's a baby. I thought a like a kangaroo and a joey. It's like a calf. What's and a, calf. a joey? A joey is a baby kangaroo. That's what. No, you... a baby kangaroo is roo. No. No. <laughs> no. It's a joey. Baby kangaroo is yeah, called joey. From from Winnie the Pooh, he was roo. Yeah. And then the mom was kanga. Okay, but do you know that <laughs> little kangaroos are called joeys, right? <laughs> you know they called the tiger Tigger too, right? And that had nothing to do with like him being a him tiger? being a tiger. <laughs> It was just a. Play, they also it was called a play the bear the poo. Joke. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> also, and piglet was a pig. Yeah. And the owl was a who? I don't know who the owl was actually. Okay, so back to the TikTok. <laughs> yeah. So what's up, what's up with the TikTok? So what's going on on the internet? Oh, Alina, Alina sent me this. This is just. Oh, sent so you this, yeah, just, but not me. Yeah, yeah was, I wanted to surprise. You. Oh, okay, okay, I'm ready. Should I close? Oh, your little rodent is here. Hi, you're a little rat. <laughs> Right? You're a little rat, right? <laughs> Come on, don't put a sweater on it. Come on. Oh, jeez. I could kick this thing 20 yards and make a field goal. <laughs> Good. Why is he shivering? Why is it shivering? Oh, great descendant of wolves, look what you've become. I mourn the loss. Just get a cat. I mean, really? At what point do you just get a cat? <laughs> I'm going to step on it. I'm gonna st- seriously, I'm gonna step on this thing. My feet are so big. Say it. Say my say my feet are hu- they're huge. My feet are huge. Yeah. Someone um, tagged me in that and said this is Sarah. I'm so like, I'm, uh, thank you for doing that. That that was you to a T. That it was you a- said you make all Why is he shivering? I- Why is he shaking? Listen, listen, listen here. I see what I've become and I hate myself. <laughs> <laughs> I won't be participating in the small dog conversation moving forward. All because of that TikTok. That really put me in my place. And that's not a joke. Perspective. That did. And I apologize. Ollie, Five if you're listening. Ago, she just said, I'm going to intercept. Oh, you didn't say that. I said an intercept. <laughs> <laughs> Ollie, I'm sorry. A public apology. And I want us to be close once I give birth. Oh, he forgives you. <laughs> yes. <sighs> anyway. Anyway, let's talk about a book. No, on a, on not a, any book, just but book. just book. There's something like I was reading. You know, as I do. What were you I reading? Think. A book, or were you reading an article, or are you reading your phone, or are you reading I'm a in a book club menu? You no, know I read books. You're still in a book club. Yeah, bitch. How do you have time for that? Is it on Zoom? I told you I don't watch TV. I've been overlooking at screens, so I've just been um, booking it up. Yeah, it's over screens. What well, do you what do you say? Isn't that nerve wracking for you to say what you think of a book? Well, kn- they're all my friends. They're not your friends. They're all my friends. It's not like I'm like embarrassed to talk to my friends about a book. <sighs> but what I was saying was, I wonder what Alina's favorite book is. What's your favorite book? I don't even know this about you. I've only read two books in your whole life, <laughs> in your entire life of living. What about book reports and stuff? Oh, yeah. I mean, you don't count. I'm not counting any. Okay, so any you've read two books for fun. For leisure. You've only read two books for fun. Oh, okay, uh, two and a half. Two and a half. Okay, so obviously the half book is your favorite because <laughs> you stopped halfway through. But what are the two... What are, Out of those two books, there's a 50-50 chance. What was your favorite of those two? Invisible wow. Monsters. Invisible... Okay, I'll read that. Was it good? It was really good. Okay. It Was it a mystery thriller? It was kind of hard to romance? explain wait what's it called i lost it <laughs> <laughs> visible monsters it's crazy the the cover looks like two different things you know when something did you that? pick it because of the cover i do pick based on i know covers. i know you judge a book by its cover but um yeah the cover was really cool it's like 
I think it can look like an old woman and then a young woman at the same time. Ooh, check out the light, check out the light. There was a big twist in it. it Ooh, kind of, I love know, a twist. It was pretty dark. It was pretty dark to be reading. I uh, love. I was, you know, 20 maybe okay. when I read it. And then show her. Let's show her. And then my second book, it had a fish in a fishbowl. And what was it called? Invisible Monsters? Mm-hmm. Uh. And I picked it because it was a cute fish in a fishbowl. Uh-huh. Uh, don't really remember anything about it. Okay. It was also kind of dark and twisted. Uh, Which one is Yeah, that one. This one? You don't see the double image? The double entendre? Oh, this is the upside down Is that what thing? that is? I have no idea. You know what a double entendre is? I thought we, none of us did. I thought we were all in agreement that no one knows what that is. Is this thing where it's upside down here? But that's not a double on entendre is like when I you say something. Words. You know. It's like when you say something and it means Maybe. another thing as yeah. well. Yeah, but you can switch around for what when it looks. No, no, no. Like something no, else. No. I don't think that's what a double entendre is. Okay, show her. Show me what? Just the the double entendre that we have here. Oh, gosh. Oh, I can't move my face. Isn't it difficult? Okay, I see the elderly. And yep. then flip it. It's like Leo and his girlfriend. You see the... <laughs> <laughs> you see the woman i can't because the light the way the oh, light is striking it you didn't see the woman right here well it's the light like the Look light is going off this oh yeah looks like snow white or like a cinderella yeah it's a great book okay I'll they're making a tv her. show <gasps> really you know they're making a tv show out of your book that will be the only one that i will be I like know. Oh, the book was better it's just three, i know three years you ago, could finally say that it's still in development oh uh, chuck palanuk yeah he he's pretty messed up Oh my god, I'm so excited about this. And then maybe maybe you could look up blue book cover with fish. No, because <laughs> it's gonna be the kids' book about the rainbow. Rain- fish. Reading rainbow. Yes. You can't do kids' book with fish. That's impossible. With goldfish. See? I know. No, no, that no, book no with was goldfish. But it, he wasn't a he wasn't a goldfish. Nah. Nah. Wait, I had I I only asked your favorite. I don't want your second favorite. Oh yes, yes. Okay. That's it. That's all I want to know. What's your favorite book? I don't have a favorite book. We can't do that because I can't <laughs> say, I'm not going to say Harry Potter is my favorite book. Well, Why not? It's fine if it is. It's a great book. Of course it's an amazing a book. book uh, which one is your favorite of the eight? Changes There's all the time. Eight, right? There's seven. There's eight movies because they split the seven into two. Yeah. See, I'm a movie gal. I don't know if I could pick a favorite book, honestly. Uh, uh, come on. No. Come on. Come on. Come on. Azkaban? <laughs> Oh, 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 of the Harry Potter books? No, Azkaban actually growing up was one of my least favorite books. Um, If I had to pick right now. You have to pick right now. I have to pick right now. I would either say Goblet of Fire or Deathly Hallows. Cool. Yeah, yeah, that's not important. The important part was I needed to know what your favorite book was because I was like, how do I not know this about Elena? Yeah. I don't think we've ever discussed Oh, I think Chuck Palahniuk did Fight Club. That's why I... It came up in your head? That's why I wanted to... Yeah, he did. Yeah. Interesting. Because Fight Club's like kind of twisted and dark, and I like twisted dark things. So oh, I was like, I know. give me the book. What's your favorite twisted dark thing? Mm-hmm. Death. Oh, no, I hate that. Uh, That's your least favorite twisted and dark Least right? favorite. Blood? I don't know. I don't know. I used to Murder? Watch American Horror Murder, Story, probably. That, no. I used to watch American Horror Story, but that got way too twisted for even me. I really liked the first season of that, and then I was gone. It was, was very out. scary. It was very scary. Very. Do you know what I like, though? That kind of reminds... I shouldn't say this. It's not really American. Alex is texting the girlfriend. Again. I know. I'm not. I'm texting Noel. <laughs> What's he saying? <laughs> That's your second girlfriend. <laughs> he's saying that he misses us? He's saying, he, he's saying how much he misses and loves you so much. Really? Yeah. And that he's never going to go on The Bachelor. It's exactly. What oh said. my God. He said, he, that was, it was actually like out of nowhere. He just texted me saying, you know what's strange? Send I just had this voice. feeling that like you guys are worried that I might go on The Bachelor or something. And he goes, oh my God. I it thought, would I was never was following happen. this. That was serious? No, he didn't say anything about loving you. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't? Oh, no. <laughs> you think we. I need he, my words of affirmation. <laughs> okay. <laughs> was he making a joke about the static? No. <laughs> he doesn't know about any of them. Should I call him? <laughs> no. I'm feeling insecure. <laughs> you you know what? To yourself. Do you ever feel insecure? No, not about <laughs> yourself. Like I just mean in your relationship. She's we're lo- we're looking at her doing. No, it right but now. like, she's, but for, for she's realsies. Picking up the phone, calling her for realsies. For realsies. Like, are you ever like, does Noel love me? Oh yeah, and okay. he goes, Alina, we're married. 
And I go, you're right. You're right. It's all good. People, <laughs> people can fall out of love oh in 10 minutes. In 10 minutes? In 10 minutes. He has been doing that for like you 11 know what? years. You know what? I <laughs> Alex was over the other day and you know, I was in his office and I just go, Noel. I'm lonely. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Alina and I are having a discussion. <laughs> like, she's hanging fully, out with somebody fully, fully, and she's yelling on the lonely. And, and like there's just a break in the conversation. She goes, Noel. He's like, what? I'm lonely. <laughs> I'm just Alex like, is like, what, what the, the fuck? fuck? <laughs> I'm just sitting here like we're in the middle of a conversation about the podcast. Oh my God. What did he come he? out? No. Did he no, you? no, no. He was in the middle of like doing some work. He just something. go I go he just goes, Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I said, I need you out here. And he didn't come out. Mm-hmm. No, he had to finish some work. He was out five minutes later. I said, I know you're playing Starcraft. He goes, I'm not. Usually he is. He was not at that time. Yeah, I get insecure. You don't. You ever get insecure? Yeah, but then I'm like, I'm married, and and then I'm like, oh, like that didn't change anything necessarily. What, what is your insecurity about? Is it, uh, am I annoying or no? I asked Corbin that this morning. I was like, do I annoy you? And he's like, yeah. I was like, wait, <laughs> that was honest. <laughs> and he's like, I'm sure I annoy you. And I was like, you don't. <laughs> <laughs> he's like no you would just say that because you're trying to be nice and i'm like no seriously i'm trying to hang out with you more yeah so and i was like maybe the more i get to know you the more i'll be annoyed by you <laughs> that's so funny yeah i do this yeah but i'm so and, and i think this is also tied to being with child like i'm so needy right now mm. in a general sense yeah, and yeah, i yeah. know i'm asking for too much like i know i'm going over the top I know I'm like, give me attention, be obsessed with me. Like, it's it's more than my normal. I'm high up there with yeah. my neediness. Like, yeah. I'm pretty needy as a person. Yeah. But I'm times Especially. Uh, yeah. The bigger the baby gets, the more needy I become. Yeah. Alex, do you get insecure? Yeah, for sure. Why do you think I'm so funny? <laughs> <laughs> Jokes come from insecurity. Absolutely. You do, yeah. Now that you're in a relationship. mm it's been quite some time. Yeah. So uh, right off the bat, you're feeling insecure. <laughs> I'm feeling pretty secure in my relationship. Yeah. So well, he's not going to say that on camera. <laughs> you think what? she listens? Yeah. Oh, she's told me she listens. Oh, wow. She Hi. Told, she told me she listens Hello. to hear my voice <gasps> from time to time. What about mine? No, yeah, what she about all of those? She like that was a diss. <laughs> that was a diss. <laughs> it's her being cute. No, my parents would be like, what does Alex look like? I'm like, you'll never know. And then here you are. <laughs> fucking just showing your face. <laughs> Like, no, imagine don't. she mutes when Alex <gasps> isn't talking. Remember when someone said they fast forward over my parts? What? Oh, yeah. Yeah, when we read our mean comments, like, I have to fast forward <laughs> over Sarah. And I was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> but now that I know I sound like that TikTok girl, like, I get it. You're you not, know what I mean? You're not even no. You're not even hearing the conversation then if you do that. Well, they I don't know. even need to hear. Well, are you saying that I don't say anything? No, no I'm like saying they're that, only hearing oh, your are parts. Are we just all dissing each other now? <laughs> no, are we you're, feeling your girlfriend is dissing us by muting us? No. And then... You, uh, uh, I'm so- I can't read you. <laughs> you took a huge leap there to take that as this. I'm saying that would be like us having a conversation and then you muting only hearing, ha- only hearing one person's part. So you don't even know what the conversation is. What are we talking about? Someone's muting <laughs> me. Thought, I did Someone you. that listens to our podcast. And please, if more people do this, like, keep to yourself. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, it hurts. So, like, anyways, I can't complete my sentence. What are we what saying? Was what I was saying was Alex dissed us. No, 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 he's not dissing us. He's not dissing us. Okay. I don't know where I'm headed with this sentence <laughs> anymore. I can, I, I can help. <laughs> Sarah said that somebody mutes her in the in the podcast. Yeah. And I'm yeah. saying. I think they're long gone. They don't listen anymore. Perfect. But what I said there, and that what you took as an insult was, why would they mute one of oh, the, the two hosts? Yeah, they wouldn't be listening to anything. Yeah. Exactly. And yeah. then I said. Are said, you saying I don't, I don't speak? Did, did yeah. you say fuck you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Are you saying they're just listening to silence? Yeah. 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 No, it makes sense. I get what you're saying because it's like, how would you know what people are talking about if you can only hear one side? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Not a diss to you. Yeah. We need to. We need to know more from your girlfriend how she's listening to us. I then. know she's listening to you guys. Who does she like more? She hasn't said that. But she likes me the most. Damn it. <laughs> Should we rock, paper, scissors for who she likes the most? <laughs> I'll, t- I'll text her. She's not allowed to pick you. Why not? If she has to pick one of the two of us. Is she more yeah. an Alina or is she more a Sarah? Yeah, who does she vibe with <laughs> Who does more? she like? Who does she resemble well, me more? Well, me, the most. How tall is she? Is she tall? No. 
Anyways. We don't need to dox in Dallas yeah, anymore. Yeah. But I, I would like to know who her favorite <laughs> was. And it can't be you. Okay. If she had to pick one of the two of us. I'm going to say, who's your favorite on the pod? Oh my God, I'm going to kill myself. And, and, and you have to clarify, it can't be you. But also, like, I'm not strong enough to take this hit. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, yeah, yeah. Honestly, go honestly, let's not get into favoritism because we've rid of those, those people yeah. who were present in our lives i would say 20 episodes ago and and they would they would pick favorites and literally have a stomach ache <laughs> and it was really mean i know it hurts yeah there was a few weeks where it was all diss into sarah and then there would be a few weeks I where know. it was all diss into me and we cried yeah 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 you guys our feelings get really hurt nope, don't pick any favorites we're in, we're married and we, we think just, our husbands are leaving us yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so random people on the internet hey, i'm about to go to work okay do i know you <laughs> do i do what do I annoy you? Do you want me to come with you? Uh, right now? I'll yes, go with you. You're annoying yeah. me. So Noel was leaving today and I... Oh, he's going yeah. away again today? No. Oh. <laughs> he just left for the day and he oh. came to give me a hug. And then he's he came back. Yeah. He didn't give me a hug. He gave me a kiss. You say give me a hickey? <laughs> honestly i would take it i know <laughs> <laughs> i would so take a hickey You're yeah i'd be like i was I'd insecure, be like, You're so obsessed with me <laughs> but no not anymore um and then he gave me a kiss and then he felt like it was a quick kiss i think so he came back to give me yeah, another yeah, kiss yeah, yeah, yeah. then he walked down and said he wait 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 up. can you give me a hug <laughs> and he came back for a third time and he gave me a hug oh that's and so that was nice. me being insecure. don't you love to be hugged i do me I too i really do it's like guys can give us a ring but what we would love more is a hickey you know what i love to be hugged from behind oh i love to be hugged from behind as yeah well. it's like, like oh, the disneyland yeah, yeah 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 the disneyland in line yeah i i despise that at disneyland her favorite's alex by the way Fuck, oh my god <laughs> <laughs> i was hoping she would say that <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't the question i know but i needed it but we'll, we'll go with it because it's probably Alina, and like he it's knows me. it's gonna be too far. It's not me. <laughs> it's, he knows it's gonna push me over the fucking. She's not me. She's sending like paragraphs about how she relates to either of you, or like <sighs> both of you. Is she neither of us? No. To no. Be- <laughs> 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 like I said, Alex, I mute them. I don't relate to them. <laughs> Listen. Oh wow, this went by so quick. I was really having a good time. <sighs> oh. Okay. Well, I have more to say in just a couple minutes in a different <laughs> section yeah. of this podcast. <laughs> Oh yeah, insecurities. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. God, my ankles right now are really high up there for me. And you're proudly displaying them on camera. Look. Well, no, my left ankle's fine. <laughs> my left ankle, you guys can check there's, it out. There's a couple of hairs right there. You know how long it took me? To sh- <laughs> you know how long it took me to shave my legs for my baby shower? Twenty five minutes. <laughs> they were longer. Tw- <laughs> th- th- this is the best I could do, Alina. I can't reach in the shower. Let me tell you something. And I'm gonna slip and fall and hurt something. myself. I always miss the ones down here, so I feel relieved right now. My friend in college said that was like a, a thing that I did, but now I can't reach my ankles. It's a, it's a tough area. Okay, well, right now, mine are gone, but I want to find them. Yeah, on one side. Sometimes like a little curly cue is oh, there. Look it, look it, look it. Let me see. You don't even have leg hair. Like, where where are you even pointing? I, I, I'm honestly more upset with you showing me this because... I can't believe you wanted like this is the you're one of the softest people I've ever touched in my life. You want to be in my skin? If you guys see Alina on the streets, touch her skin, okay? She accepts it. She wants it. This this bitch is so fucking soft. I can't even handle. How, uh, just touch my legs. Touch your legs. Now touch my legs. Uh, I mean, I might as well just be like a fucking cactus over here. Disgusting. It's like I'm touching <laughs> shea butter. It's crazy. The lotion. I maybe I should have been putting on lotion longer in my life, but I just kind of let it go, let it flow. I ain't worried. Whatever. See you guys on the next day. See you on the bonus. <laughs> See you around. If you don't know, we go to the bonus. We go to the bonus here and we do an extra segment. And we'll put the link right here because I'm done saying it out loud because I can't do it. Because she says dot com, you guys. I say a dot com, an extra one. Alice? <laughs> okay, are we ready? Yep. Do you have to pee pee? Oh. <laughs> <laughs>